What was your project with this new book? I began, uh, my friends used to ask me, or during some conversations, some memories. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. No problem. Used some memories jump back, uh, some events that uh, they connected to what we were talking about. And I used to tell those uh, like stories. Then I thought I should write them down. So I kept writing down. So the book really consists of uh, about 150 such uh, memories of some events, some uh, uh, of lighter sort of nature. Some of them are more serious uh, that I wrote down during a period, maybe 20 years. It was not something that I sat down and wrote all the stories in one, like in one week or so. Yes, yes, yes. No, I just then later I put them together. I thought, ah, oh, I should put them together and make it into a book. And that's what this book is all and about. And it's not chronological, right? No, no, totally, uh, as it jumped to my memory. Uh, and I uh, totally, uh, no, no pro chronology. But they all have to do with, with my life, with the people I knew, with some events that took place uh, connected with uh, much of the 60s, 70s, uh, uh, the cinema, the independent cinema, the avant-garde cinema. But it's not all cinema. Uh, some of it, like some social events, like, like uh, uh, censorship, film censorship, or, Mm. Still, still, it's cinema. <laughs> but sometimes, uh, I know there is not all about cinema. Yes. Mm. 